today? Obviously it's disappointing, uh, the manner of the way we conceded the goal is, is disappointing. To do it once is, is poor from us, to do it twice, you know, it's, it's, it's disappointing, it really is. Um, I felt with 10 men, the positive signs were we were excellent with 10 men, shifted the ball and started to build a little bit of pressure. Um, I felt for the rest of the game, certainly the first, the first half was pretty cagey affair. Um, no, neither team wanted to fully commit to what they were doing, didn't want to make mistakes and you know, the, the standard was pretty low to be honest with you. Um, second half, obviously those decisions change it. Um, I've not seen them back so maybe the lads got a slight nudge, um, but the moment you raise your hands in the penalty box you, you're asking for trouble. Yeah, because we've seen it quite a, a, bit, a bit in the summer in the World Cup, isn't it? The handball's given and like you say, above, above shoulder height, you're always running that risk, aren't you? Yeah, you are. Um, there were bodies around each individual, um, but like I say, I've not seen it back yet. It's, it's difficult to describe because you're not in the heat of the, the moment in the round, you're penalty box and defending the box. We generally don't give away cheap goals. Um, I don't want us to make a habit of it, that's for sure. Um, but the, the bonus I'll take from today is a, is a performance with 10, ten men. Um, we really did grow into the great game um, and created some half chances. It's always difficult against 11. Um, and I, they're a good, good team as well, so disappointing day. Obviously, they will get a suspension and John will picked up an injury. Um, so it's a, a hurtful day all around, really. Yeah, um, drawing on the positives, they were a good save, save from Christy Pym. And, and like you say, sometimes you, when, when you go down to 10 men, it, it's difficult and they have to work harder, but you grew into the game. Yeah, definitely, but they had to, you know, you see it's often when a team goes down to 10 men, they have to get on the ball, because they can't just keep it, like, kick it long, so we had to get on the ball, we had to move the ball, we got them deeper on the back of a bit of pressure, um, without really hurting them properly, but you can't ask for too much more from them than 10 men, um, it's just disappointing to, to start the second half in that manner, um, so we'll look at it and we'll, we'll push ourselves off and go again Tuesday. Um, how um, serious is John Jono's injury? Do you know at all? We don't know yet. You know, it happened in the first minute of the game, so it's 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 his muscle, which is a, a problem because he's a quick player, he's a sprinter. Um, so I'm, we'll find out how long he's out for. And obviously, you've got that suspension going into the next game as well, so it, it pull them yeah. on Tuesday. Yeah, night. but it's another opportunity. You know, Luke Kroll came on there and did it exceptionally well. Um, Dar O'Shea will get game time. The, the lads in and around it who may feel they're on the fringe of things will get game time. They've got to keep making an impact. They've all got to be ready. Lee Martin came on after two minutes, well, after five minutes today. Um, so look, I've got a good enough squad to deal with it, that's for sure. Um, but just the, the manner of the, the two penalties is, is what's disappointing today.